We are part of the UN task team on the post-2015 development agenda, which submitted its first report to the Secretary General of the United Nations, in which human rights were identified along with equity and sustainability as fundamental principles for the agenda that we're discussing today. Democratic governance and a full respect for human rights are prerequisites for empowering people to make sustainable choices. The right to take part in government is enshrined in the international treaties that all of the members of the African Union, all of the member states, all of the countries that you represent here have ratified and are state party to. And finally, human rights can offer us standards that help to define goals and targets for global development agenda. And especially the human rights mechanisms offer us tools that we can consider in this discussion. Therefore, please allow me not to eat too much into the time for your tea break to raise five questions that could maybe inform us in the discussion over the next one and a half days. First of all, the question of universality, which is a core human rights principle and also a core principle of governance. Should the global post-2015 agenda be universal or should it just apply to the countries most in need? The question of the indivisibility of rights. What do we understand by freedom from fear and freedom from want? What aspects of life must be guaranteed to achieve these freedoms? The question of equality and non-discrimination. What are the effects of inequality on governance? How can we address inequality? How can we address discrimination? The question of accountability and rule of law. Who is responsible for governance? How do we ensure accountability? And finally, the question of participation and inclusion. Who can participate? Who can, who should be consulted in the preparations of the post-2015 agenda? I hope that these five questions coming from the human rights perspective will be interesting for us to discuss over the next one and a half days. And I wish us all successful and fruitful deliberations. And I thank you very much for your attention. Merci beaucoup. Obrigado. Shukran.